Hello and welcome everybody to yet another exciting episode of Carlin Brothers Box Breakers, or as we like to call it, CBQ. Carlin Brothers Box Breakers. That's what I said. Yeah, yeah, full name, full title, all full, the time. All the time, yeah, yeah, yeah. in, in parenthesis, yeah. For, for no reason whatsoever. Yeah. I mean, why are we adding math to our title? I don't Cube? Know. Come on. It's not the worst. Nerds. <laughs> As ever, let's take a quick look at the rules. Jay and I will be opening a booster pack from the latest collection. Any rare cards, cards that feature a star, score points. Scoring is very simple. We head on over to the current price list on TCG Player and determine your rare card or card's value. That value is rounded up to the nearest whole number. But the fun doesn't stop there. Each week, we'll also spin the wheel of energy to determine this episode's type advantage. If the energy in your pack matches the type advantage, then your entire pack gets a two times multiplier, and you get an additional point for each mon of that type in your pack. Lastly, there are also three randomly chosen common chase cards that are worth one additional point each. So if your energy card matches the type advantage, you pull two randomly chosen common chase cards and your rare card is worth $3.75, that will be rounded up to four plus two points for the common chase cards gives you six points times two for the energy and your final score is 12. And now as ever time for the wheel of inertia. Oh man, what are we gonna land on today? Will we need to move the skateboards? We're about to find out, could it be the one and only? What do we, what do we want? Oh, it's dark. Dark teardrop oh, man. energy. Well, we gotta put, every, everyone needs an opportunity to put Umbreon in the middle. No one's complaining about that. Nobody's though. complaining about that. Did you step on, you're making all my lights flicker back I there. I think I stepped on one of the cords, yes. Classic Jay, he always steps on all the cords. As long as none of the cameras came like that. All right, Umbreon! Boom! There we go. All right, well, that's an exciting one. And today's randomly chosen common chase cards are going to be Solosis, Slugma, and Sharpedo. Hey, Sharpedo's fun. I feel like we've seen a lot of that one. And Slugma, for that for that note. Yeah. Um, also, update on the team competition. Wow. We've currently got Team Fire, thanks to Razia the King last episode. Absolutely crushing it. They are in first place with 174 points, followed by Team Grass with 126 points, Team Water with 92, and Team Electric, who started last week's episode in second, is now in Fourth. In, wow, I told you, water was like slowly gaining points. They what? had a bunch of solid middle ground numbers. That's exactly it. So water currently <clears throat> has uh, a 36 pointer, a 17, a 17, a 12, and a 10. Ugh. So like they're they're like every, I think their their fifth person is in 14th place. <laughs> so <laughs> either way, fire has a 48 point lead and that's almost all that matters at this point. That is almost all that matters unless <clears throat> we open something epic in today's episode. Which hopefully we will and hopefully it'll be our very First contestant, Monkey Bacon. Monkey Bacon. All right, let's see. What do we got? This is, of course, our father-son duo. Uh, dad is bacon, son is monkey. Oh, I had it reversed. You I was trying to like say the words as you were saying it. Yeah. There. We're, oh, right out of the gate. Right we out of the type gate. Type advantage. Let's see it. We got the heat more. The yamper, Toracat grub, and the buddy buddy poffin. Iron treads, boss. Oh, the boss. I told you, what a pack. What a pack indeed. And yeah. this is for Team Electric. So they're oh, yeah. like, you know what? We need to, we need to uh, bounce back right here. They say, no way, Jose, $9.19 for that Master Ball. So that's gonna be 10, 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, times two is 28 points. 28 points right out of the gate. Wow, for what a- Team Electric, what wow. What an absolutely electric start. Indeed. As they say, 24 points, so Monkey Bacon, coming in, laying the gauntlet down and saying no. We are electricity and we are here to fight. Right here, the team competition, very spicy this go around. All right, next up we have got uh, Reginald Munion. Reginald Munion. Here we go, all right. What, that, what, if, what if we, I feel like we've had all the ace deck cards come towards the back of the boxes for whatever reason. And that was the first pack. That was the first pack, so yeah. So let's see, we got the, the salad energy there. What are we doing with today? Oh, dark, dark teardrop, yeah. right? The giraffe egg, the roselia, the cutie fly, the drill burr, that was been good last week. Yep. The iron juggly ulis, mm -hmm. uh, the delmize, the electivire. Oh, oh the, the critical electivire, hit! The critical hit on the electivire, electivire, and then we got the car coal, which will not score the dunce bar. The dunce bar, so oh, just, just two the points. Two points off the double electivire. Man. Would have been a great pack last week. It would have been a great pack last week. There was a Not lot today. going on there, but unfortunately, yeah, this week we're missing out on a whole bunch of those. All right, next up we've got 1909 Graz fan. 
I don't know what that means. Graz fan? Grazzy fan? Do you think Graz is a person? A player? Graz could be. Um, a public figure? 1909. 1909. The year 1909. Yeah. Boy, this is a puzzle. If you know what this is a reference to, let us know. I'm pretty sure Ethan knows. I think he's told me before. Okay. But I don't remember. All right. Eyeball energy. So no type of advantage. Grodel. Finizen. Bronzor. Great Tusk. Bronzong. Booster. Capsule. Relor. The Haunter will score. And the Drampa. There we go. It's a beautiful Haunter. It is. I like we haven't seen a lot of those. Yeah. So just two point points, pack. though. No chase cards or type advantages the speed well we have the haunter with the type i can't believe so. this slugma i feel like we even had like a critical hit with slugmas last week they have been everywhere so you're right i'm surprised all right we've got aaron b a a ron a a ron all right let's see here what we're gonna we see at least the dark pokemon already there we go we got, the metal metal. we got to get the ekans the turtwig the, the Pugiano, the score the wiglet the heavy baton the iron valiant the sandy shocks the bianca's devotion will not score the zero aura will not score but the torterra Tortero will there number we go. 12 on the set it's a front pager mm. just 40 cents we've why? pulled one before why are the front pagers always so bad i just don't know so is it just three points just three points just three there three points despite the B. four but you do get the Torterra, so that's fun. There you fun. go. Better luck next time, indeed. All right, next up we've got Shauna. Shauna! Oh boy, Shauna has been playing long enough that we had to get her a brand new card. It looks so clean. So clean, everything's all so freshened crazy. up and everything. Oh, I see what happened. Shauna, Shauna, oh wow, this is, uh, this is a new move. Shauna has moved from electric to water. Whoa! For season 11. They've been scouting, Ben. They've been scouting, they've been like, they've been like all right, look, I'm gonna make my move here. Fire, water, neither of them has taken home a title yet. I'm wow. gonna switch to water. So far, it seems like the wrong Let's choice, but see. could this change everything? Will Shauna switch? Make any difference at all. Fireball energy. We got the frostball, knockdown, crocodile, licky licky, rebombi, energy capsule, iron hands, fortress, bolton, and the one, one trio. trio. Oh, Boy, man. a lot of electric cards in there. Again, would have been good last week, but nothing doing this week. Yeah, number 60 on the set. That's just 33 cents. Oh, in that no. one trio. So single point. Just so a single point. So water welcomes Shauna, but no big points thus far. I feel like that fire energy off the top was sort of like 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 fire team fire over there being like, hey, we tried. We, we tried. tried to recruit you to our team. We said but no, come here. You said team water and we said whatever. Here we go. All right. Speaking of team fire, now we have Kevin, Kevin. up to the plate. I love this one because we always have their real names and then their names that they have chosen to go by. And it, it seems hilarious to me what Kevin's real name is versus versus what they, what, cho what they, yeah, they asked by. us to call him Kevin. <laughs> Kevin it is. All right. So we got the, mm -hmm. the lightning bolt energy, the Relor, the Ponytail, the Chatot, the Cottony, the Chinchino, the Sableye. Scores. Oh, there you go. Good save. Good save. We got the Great Tusk, the Roselia. Oh. No, oh, why did no. I think there was I already one was of those? Two. Nope. Um, does not score. The Litten will not score. And the, the Roaring. Roaring Moon to close two things. points. Two points. So there good, good save. Yep. So three, three. Point pack there. I'm, All right. I'm so bad at spotting the dark energy. So I know. We have to be like on our P's and Q's. I know. It's only on the wheel one time. So it's uh, easy. We don't get it very often. We don't get it very often. Yeah. All right. Next up, we got Carly B. Carly B. Here and have to be go. confused with Carly Wow. Carly Wow. Carly Wow, who is consistently pulling just massive, massive cards. This is Carly B. Okay. Who is, I think, you know, uh, like a Carly apprentice. A Carly. A, a Carly in training. A Carly in training. Okay. But we expect big things. We, I mean, let's let's see if we can pull something big here. Then we got the we're, Hunter. We're yeah. starting off good. We got two. Oh, and the Buddy Buddy Poffin. Uh oh. There we go. There we the go. Of the Roaring Moon will score twice, twice. and the Mariah. There so we look go. at that. See, see, that's Carly energy. If I've ever that seen is. it. I've ever seen it. So that's gonna be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight points. Man, eight off of just otherwise nothing, you know? Right. A really good, bro. I love it when people string together tiny cards for big points. It's strategic play. It it's is. really what it is. Very it really good. is. Yeah, so Team Electric in last place at the start of the day. I mean, granted, that was only an eight point pack, but between them and Monkey Bacon with 24 points, Team Electric has the best showings so far today. Wow, man, they are just, they came to play. They, they came, came to play. play. Next up is Brawn. Team Brawn. Well, Team Brawn for Team Water. Team Brawn for, yeah, Brawn for Team Water. There we go. All right, here we go. We got the Salad Energy off the top, the Meltan, the Sea Dot, the Totodile, the Deerling, the Reunculus. The Miss Energy will score. The Miss Energy will score. The Saws Buff will not. Oh, oh the Prime Catcher. Catcher, which we know is the one. Oh, and it's a critical hit on the Reunculus. Oh my gosh, there oh. we go. And the Fluttermane to close Dude, out. The okay. Fluttermane was present on that big hit last week, too. How it about It is like a that? good luck charm. It is indeed. All right, so let's check out that Prime Catcher. Is is that, is that the big one? Is that the uh, one? I think so, yeah. I think this is like the 30 point one, right? It is 31.05, yeah. so 
32 points. So 32, and then 33, 34, and then times two is gonna be 68. Did you oh, count this one? No, I'm sorry, you're right. Sorry, 34, 35, so times 70. 70 points what? for Team 70 Water. 70 points, and just like that, that has gotta be the highest points for water all season. Goodness gracious, will it be enough is the real question. Let's see, because I don't think it will, because even if they get the full 70, it's gonna be it close. It would be a little less than that, but assuming it's the full 70, it's 162 points. Okay, okay, so. so they're, what they're, but that puts them in 12 point range. That is that is striking. That is sense. very attainable. You and can make up that ground with five players. If you remember, I said last week, I said, you did. I said, you did. I, I thought not, nothing against Rozzy, but I thought there was a chance that he would not be able to sit atop the podium the whole time. That's striking. Well, there you right go. There. I cannot believe the, the big hits we've had on big cards this season. It has been crazy. Well, here we go. All right, next up, we've got Heartbeat. And my heart is beating after that last pull. It has to be this said. Is, this is Team the Fire catcher. looking to answer after Team Water has just taken such third, a big stab. Around 70, they made up a huge portion of the lead. Grass was feeling good at the beginning of last week, and now I think they're in third. Matang, Car Carcoal, Finnison, Rescue Board, Sandy Shocks, the Hand Trimmer, the Iron Valiant will not score, the Chat Dot will not, the Flutter Main unfortunately is not bringing the luck in this pack. Not so much, unfortunately. Just 41 cents for the value on that flutter main on a single point pack. So not even really like the, the last place potential that you might be looking for. I know, yeah, wow. So flutter main giveth and flutter main taketh away. There it is. There we go. All right, next up we have Akron Guy. Akron Guy from Akron, Ohio. Probably. Is that, is that, the, is that where Akron is? That is where Akron is, Okay, yeah. Yeah, well, there we go. Points to me for knowing my geography. The Zips. The, the Zips? Yeah, that's their, uh, that's the Akron University. That's their that's their. Oh, interesting. I think it's I a kangaroo. Know. Okay, well, how about it? The Carvana, the Ekans will score, the Turtwig, the Pucciana will score, the Morty's Conviction, Shiftery, Bianca's Devotion. I feel like I've seen this pack before. Yeah, right. The Iron Hands will not score. The Scyther, the Scyther. will be signed, the Karaidon. So just three points there for Akron Guy of Ohio. Go Zips. I only know that because they play the Hokies every now and then, or they used to. There you go. So we got the... Go Tech Go. Go Tech Go. There we go. So you get your signed card, if nothing else. There you else. go. So and enjoy the total points? So three points total there for Akron Guy. All right, there we go. And you got your Scyther. That's really that's really the best one you can get. And it was a reverse hollow one. Not so bad. You know? Not so bad. All right, if I recall, Ben, next up, it is our last season's champions, Haley and Colin. Haley and Colin. Bam, here we go. Pulled it out with 51 points. 51 it came down points. to a nail biter in the end as well. So What's crazy is that 51 was enough to win last season, and we've already pulled three packs this season in round one worth more than 50. I know, it's unbelievable. It is wild. It's unbelievable. Rock is pummeling. Ghastly is there. Sizzlepede, Merrill, Sharpedo will score. Metagross, Roserade, the Deerling, the Excadrill, and the Coridon. Where are the Slugmas? Where are the Slugmas? Just three points. We got our first Sharpedo of the day, right? Is it the first one? I think so. So there we go. A little, a few different ways to score, but not a lot of points, not a lot unfortunately. Of points for, the, for the defending champs. There we but, go. We'll see. Right. We'll see next week. It seems like it seems like there's that like Game of Thrones King's Blood thing. It's like once you've been a champ once before, you've been it's there. like yeah, it's like they can do it again. Correct. Exactly. Exactly. All right. This is going to be John Smith. Jamestown Settler. Yep, very impressive, very impressive, especially <clears throat> the lifespan. Um, I know, that you're still here. That's that's the main thing. Uh, How that, many other places I'm have you founded? Marking as the accolade. All right, so we got the Pie Dove, the Pine Co., the Mawile, the Meditite, the Cypher Maniacs, the Behemoth. I hate this one, I can't pronounce it. Dude, it, not only is it unpronounceable, it's like the most forgettable Pokemon ever. Like what, just, what even is it? I, you know, it's hard to say. It looks like a pile of rocks. It or looks something. like like a mushroom rock with traffic light hands. You yeah, know? yeah. Why not? What why is not? going on? Ancient booster energy capsule. The licky licky. The mighty Anna will score. The iron valiant. So just two just points two for points John for Smith. Old John Smith. There you go. And I mean old. Quite old. Very, very old. Shockingly. Surprisingly. <laughs> Probably breaking records. All right, next up we have from the Mod Squad, it is Dakota. Dakota, Dakota, last we spoke to her, we we swear up and down we're doing our best for Dakota. We're trying, and okay. And her response was, it doesn't seem like it. it, doesn't, it she doesn't, doesn't think we're trying. She's like, no, I don't think so. I don't so. think you are. And so poor, like, yeah, poor Dakota, who is also a mod as well, so got the mod we go. curse. Here it is. Flourish. You, you snuck out the, the secret bad pack, right? Exactly. From, from yeah. your hip pocket. That's right. <laughs> you got a hip flask. There we go. That would have been great last week, Dakota. 
Maybe. There's the Mighty Anna, so there's there we some go. points. We got some points. The, the Haunter. Haunter. All right, we're doing All right. something. The Fortress, the Full Metal Lab, the Sharpedo, Carvana, and the Marina. All that's, right. That's not. Okay. That was, that was better. It was right? better. It was Come better. on. Let us know. Let us know how we're doing in the towel section down below. So that's 62 cents for that Mariah. So just one point. Oh, so it's four just four points, points overall. So no. I gotta say, Jay, I think we're still in the doghouse with Dakota. At the I moment, think so. Unfortunately, we but have that's, not redeemed her yet. That's okay. There's always next month. There is. There's always the possibility we can do this. All right. Next up is Emerald Phoenix. Emerald Phoenix. Here we go. Emerald Phoenix of. Um, Google Hangout fame. Yeah. Another yeah. It's our SCB Patreon instead, where you can hang out with us on Google. Not on Google, on Zoom. On Zoom. It started out on Google. Now it's on Zoom. Now it's on Zoom. There we go. So we talk with Emerald like once a month. We do. We know yeah. we know Emerald. We've got the the salad energy, the wiglet, the Meltan, the C dot, the Totodile, the Reunculus, the Explorer's Guidance, the Latius, the Palafin will not score, the Pie Dove will not score. Yeah. The, oh. Well the Macargo. Wow. Have we had more Macargos than Slugmas this week? We have indeed. Look, 29 just that's just it's just five cents. It's just five cents it's just for five Emerald. Cents. Yeah, so Emerald, Emerald now a chief contender for last place. No doubt. Out. I we're gonna say that's it. been the case before. No, it hasn't. Okay. I think it started season eight. Season maybe? eight, yeah, maybe. Was, yeah, uh, they came we were, yeah. Yeah, but oh well. All right, we'll see how Emerald does. We'll keep an eye on them. All right, next up is Kitten Ninja. Kitten Ninja. Yeah, here we go. Coming in, they've been uh, they've only fucked up two points a season here in the past couple, but those were a single, you know, single pack seasons. So right, let's right, see if we yeah. can outdo their whole season. Dark Tear Dub. That's a there great start. Go. We will yeah. at least match. We will at least match the two points. Dunspar, Snom, Mudbray, Excadrill, Keldeo, Delmize, Elgium, the Rabskill will not score. Oh, and, and the Macargo! No. Come on! Wow. I, I said at least match as if, because I was positive we'd get more than two and we still did it. So <laughs> poor Kitten Ninja needs to join uh, Dakota in the, the legion of people who we can do better for. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. I'm sorry, and Kitten back to back Ninja. Macargos. That was no, weird too. It's, it's disappointing to say the least when you get two flaming snail Pokemon back to back. Exactly. <laughs> All right, next up we have the Burbinator. The Burbinator. The crowd favorite. Yeah, yeah. I enjoy a good bourbon, you know. Bourbon's not bad. Yeah. Do you have a favorite? A favorite bourbon? Yeah, favorite bourbon. I think my favorite is uh, Jefferson Age Jefferson Aged at Sea. It is really cool. It is it's so like, good because it's at, because it's at sea in the barrels as it sloshes. Yeah, it gets more exposure to it's the barrel exposure. itself. It's, it's got like delicious. a nice like uh, maybe it's just in my mind. It feels like it's got like a little bit of like a salty hint on it. How about that? Yeah. Maybe it's just like in the air. It's like maybe it's, it's in the air. It's in the yeah. essence. It's so good either way. Yeah. yeah. There you go. There we go. I All got right. some for Christmas. We got the Turdinator, the Hoot Hoot, the Beldum, the Heat More, the Rapid Ash. Look at all the fire. Gracious, if this was a fire, we would be losing our minds right now. But like double one, two, three. We got the Boltund, the Mudsdale, the Box Order, a Macargo again. again, and the Iron Thorns. But seriously, so. if it was fire. I know, it would have been amazing. Um, yeah, but just a two point just pack. Just a two point pack. So this, but I mean. Somehow well, the Macargo got worse because that was the reverse hollow instead of just the regular. Or maybe that's rarer, honestly. I don't want to say it because I feel like what everybody's thinking it, we're, I think we're in a rut. I think you we're think in a so? rut. Yeah, we need, someone to, we need someone to lift us. We need someone to lift us. This is maybe, maybe Jupiter Fox for Team Grass can be the hero that grass needs at the moment because they started out like, at the start of last week, they were sitting pretty. They were, you they know? were, yeah. It was their game to lose and so far they have. Let's see if Jupiter can uh, change that around. We have Eyeball Energy, that doesn't score. The Ghastly, the Elgim, Sizzlepeed, the Golurk, Shaman, Cypher Maniac, Sableye, Frostmoth, and Iron Valiant. So just, just three, three points, points for Jupiter Fox there. Boy, they got some. Well, they they had a good season back in season seven with thirty two points, but not much of a return to glory since then. All right, next up we've got Tina Doge. Tina Doge. Tina Dodge. I don't know why I'm saying Doge, but it's okay. Like Doge, like Dogecoin. Yeah, like Dogecoin. Yeah. Yeah. You to think this is that Tina? Yeah. That yeah, Doge. Yeah. Tina, it wasn't spelled differently, but but why not? Why okay. not? Yeah. Tina Probably Doge. the inventor of Dogecoin. Right. Um, so we got the Deerling, the Pie Dove, the Pine Co, the Ma Wild, the Ancient Booster Energy Capsule, the Iron Treads, the Buddy Buddy Poffin will score. The Whimsicott will score. Oh, the Arbok J. Look at this. Whoa. That's Look a, at that that's guy. That's a neat one. And, and the Dark right. Boy. And, and yeah, the Dark Boy. There we go. Got to remember that extra point. So one seventy six. I was really hoping. Doge was gonna get the bolt on here because it kind of has that uh or a yamper 
Oh, kind of has yeah. that like derpy Dogecoin look to that's it. True, yeah. That's true. That's true. Okay, so the Arbok is I think our first of the season four dollars fifty nine cents. So that's five, five six six because of the dark type energy. And, and raging the, bolt is one twenty three. That's Scyther's number. Fun fact. One two three. Let's see, it's gonna be a dollar seventy-eight, so you Six, get an extra point on that one. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve! Not bad, honestly. 12? Not bad at all. Twelve points for Dogecoin. And and uh Team Fire over there <laughs> being like, that's right, that's right. That's they're, right. they're clapping from the bench, they're they proud are. of their 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 uh comp compatriot? Is that, how do you say <laughs> that word? Yeah, that's right. The compatriot? Yeah. There's like an M in there. Yeah. Not copatriot. Compatriot? Compatriot. Yeah. Oh, the compatriot. Yeah. Yeah. They're compatriot. Yeah, they're like, we got it. Take home the double ultra rare. Bring it home. Bring That's it home. It. That's it. We want those pins. All right, next up we have Stefan and Susie, another power couple here. Love a good power couple in the they game. Do. You know, for a while we didn't have anyone like rise to the top, and then Haley and Colin last month. Oh, they did it. They just did it. They Damn. finally took people down. They said, move over. Move and, and then over. they did it. They won. Ah! Woo! There we go. Fireball energy okay. here. Minchino, Rockruff, Litten, Shroomish, Electivire, Chinchino, Future Energy Capsule, Duosion, Roserade, and Roaring Moon will be worth two points because it's a dark type. Oh, there we go. Okay, there so we just go. two points just for Super Stefan, Stefan and, Susie. and Susie. One point per person. You guys can argue about who gets the Roaring Moon, who gets to wear it around their neck like a necklace and a badge of honor. Yeah. Which is why I assume most of you guys do with your rare cards after you mail them to you, you. You can almost only imagine. Yeah. In fact, maybe we should sell like a chain, you a know, like chain. a gold chain yeah. that has like, like a, a little, little yeah, like a sleeve. Case. Yeah, yeah, that hangs down from it. That way people can wear it everywhere they go. Don't think we won't, people. Uh, we got to think of new quarterly merch a lot around here. We do indeed. We do indeed. Actually, our quarterly merch from last month was amazing. Yeah. From, from the first quarter, we made these tote bags, and they look like those thank you bags, oh. but it says box breakers all across them. Pretty good. Pretty Truly good. Truly glorious. If you want to yeah. check it out, you can actually upgrade your box breakers uh, patronage to the quarterly merch tier uh, for an extra $15 a month, and then yeah. you get a cool piece of merch yeah, every cool quarter. Stuff. Like this this mat that we're opening on with the Scyther and the Fear, this was a piece of quarterly this, merch once upon a this time. This was one of those. Yeah. yeah. So be sure to check it out. All um, right. Next up we have Faith. Faith. Gotta have it. You got to have it in this game. Especially. All right, Faith, let's see what we can do for you here. Set that guy aside. We got our metal energy. We got the Roly Coley, the Azumarill, the Yamper, the, Yamper. the Grubber, the Explorer's Guidance, the Colossal, the Perilous Jungle, the Rescue Board will not score. The Cottony will not score. Oh, Ooh, but the Morty's, Morty's Conviction. Morty's Conviction. That's gonna score. Let's see what number is that. Two hundred one. Okay, let's take a peek real quick. Let's take a peek. Two fifty four for Morty. That's gonna be three points there for Faith. Better than nothing. Better, Better than, than nothing. nothing. Honestly, pack. yeah. I mean, it's I. It, it's like one of those where I feel like that pack. Like if you just like went and bought a pack from the store, you'd feel better about it maybe than just three points. But yeah, it's, yeah. It's a solid you got a full art trainer. That's exactly. always good. You know. Are you gonna play Morty's Conviction? I don't think so. But you never know. Well, you got it. You got it. Next up is Big Jake. Big Jake. I think. I wonder if most people are just looking for collector value out of the game. You know, rather than gameplay. Probably anyway. Probably. Probably. I would think that would so. be my guess. Yeah. Got the Water Energy, the Meryl, Golet, Dunspar, Snom, Vikavolt, Great Tusk, Salvatore, the Feraligator will score. The Maul oh, will not, Gengar. but look at that, Gengar! Oh, wow, that's, glory! That is glorious. Go ahead and now, give Now, talk a about a Pokemon that the Pokemon Company likes is Gengar. That is true. Number 193 is gonna come in at $20. What? Eight cents. Holy crap, we underreacted to we that did. one. We did. 20. It's, 21 points? 21 points for that Gengar. All right, so 22 overall. 22, My goodness, man. for Big Jake and Big Gengar. Big Jake is excited, because you got a marked up for Alligator by Jake. Reverse hollow with that. There you go. And the Gengar worth 22 points. Team Electric, who again, came in came into the day in last place in the team competition. They are just, they are not taking that laying They're down at all. Throwing it is, down it is, the points. It is not over until it is, so we continue. <laughs> all right, next up is uh, Jacob C. Jacob C, I think you're Here up. Here we go, oh, I'm up. Here we go, you know what? It's gonna be this pack. Oh, no way. I'm I going think for this it. is a hand selected hand by selected me. Hand selected by Ben, hand opened by Jay. There we go. As most, you know, you have a 50% chance of that happening. That's true, that's true. Or apparently a slightly higher chance that it'll be me if the numbers are anything to rely on. Here we go, lightning bolt energy. 
Rock Rock, Litton, Shroomish, Lickitung, Iron Hands, Morty's Conviction, Shiftry. Oh, critical hit on the Shroomish. Shroomish. I got the Melton and oh, the Gouging Fire. Okay, That's okay. Bad. You got a critical hit there, but will it be worth anything or is it just going to be just a sad two points? $1.24. It, okay, it is two it is points. four points. So four points. Okay. Yeah, All right. yeah. So better that, than nothing. Better than nothing. Better well, than nice nothing. Nice hand-picked pack, Ben. Hey, thank you, thank you. Yeah. I, do, I do what I can. There you go, Jacob C. Gouging Flame coming your way. Next up, we have got uh, Tim and Tonic. Tim, Tim and Tenic, I believe. Tim and right? Tenic. Tim oh. and Tenic. There we go. Yes, yes, indeed. For Team Fire, I think oh, we got a little little trio of fire, a blaze, as they like we to call do. it. We do. Yes, they're coming in in three packs in a row here. All right. So Team Fire has got like a power play, if you will. Can they do it? Let's Feels see. like we could be running into this. Is maybe as a play for the second Ace spec. Let's see. So we got the Metatite, the Turdinator, the Hoot Hoot, the Beldum, the Lycan Rock, the Del Caddy, the Future Booster Energy Capsule, the Ponyta, the Arbok. Arbok scores. Will score. You're correct. And the Relicanth will That's as well, but just right. two points. So the beginning of the blaze has not quite heated up that's to okay. the intensity. They're playing down. the spread. They're playing you know? the spread. That's right. That's right. They came together. So we got Tim and Tenic, PC and Bobby coming together as a convoy, yeah. looking to looking to do some work as a team for Team Fire. So let's see if PC can pick up where Tim and Tenic left off. Bam, grass, so no uh, type advantage here. The slug mode will score fine, this. long Solosis, Solosis. Solosis. The Scyther. The Scyther won't score, but it's awesome. Great Tusk, Delcaddy, Glow, uh, Guidance, Rabombi, Caldeo, and the Iron Thorn. So there it's going to be a three point pack. There we go. Make sure to Two sign three that point Scyther we'll sign for that PC. For you. So. So the, the blaze continues still. We got a two, a three. The question is, will we see four or more on the next one? I like how that worked out. I know. Enjoy your signed Scyther there, PC. All right, so let's see if the fire strategy has worked out here with Bobby. That's Bobby with two Ys. You could probably tell how I was pronouncing it, but just in case you couldn't. Now you know, now you know. All right, they came, they're they coming off a 20, no, not 29 point season, two seasons, no, I don't know, season six. It looks like they took a break for a while is what happened. That's why it's confusing on the sheet. Anyway, will they score points for fire? Can they complete the spread? Or will they fizzle out? Let's see. Oh, oh here we go. All right, so Team Fire. Man, they're, they're all they're, they're, like a deep breath is being held right now. Letting the bronze on the Excadrill, the Scream Town, the Energy Capsule, the Hoot Hoot. And oh. unfortunately, it is the two cent card. It is about as bad as it is capable of being the, the Blaze mm. of Fire. Came through with a two, a three, and a one, or a one, wow. a two, a three. Man. Now, at the very least, you could say, and this is a very least statement, that Mel Metal, this this is the single worst pack you can pull. It is a two cent pack, so you are in dead last, which is a winning position. You're so, incapable of doing worse. So it doesn't it doesn't help the fire team competition, but at least maybe you guys get like some participation points by association. That's you know? right. That's right. Yeah. And that's yeah. to say we gotta still aim low for the rest of the season here, Bobby with two Y's. Which is probably what he's saying right now. Why? Why? Nice. Thank nice. you. Thank you. All right, next up is Christina. Christina. Or team Water. Can Christina capitalize on the little momentum that Fire built with their spread and sort of sneak in there and steal their glory? You know, like when you sealed that last pull on the slot machine. I know, I know, I know. I've seen it before. So we got the teardrop energy, which matches nicely with, with Christina's team Water. We got the Medichan, yeah. the Tranquil. Have we Mr. any Tranquils? I don't even remember a Mr. Mime either. These are, these seem like new right cards. Set. <laughs> the Raichu, the Umfazont, the Centiscore. The Eerie, the Vika Volt will yeah. not score, the Electabuzz will not score, and the Whimsicott. Whimsicott. Man. Man, a single so, point. So, Christina. Just six cents on that one as well, worth writing down, right, just in case we'll for Christina. Down. So, uh, Bobby and Christina, you know, these two were, they were in the turnstile together, waiting to come in for their competitions. You could tell they were giving each other, like, the look, yeah. the eyes. And unfortunately, they both they both threw down about the same kind of performance. Right. Bobby with a slight edge. All right, next up for the mod squad, it is Doe, whose son has won a season before. Yes, indeed. Right. Yeah, Chase has won a season. Yes, so there is that. Now, the thing about th this particular pack is that we had those three fires in a row. We had a single break, and now we're back to fire. Okay, so now we're back to fire. Perhaps this is the true end of the blaze. I had to like let one slot go somewhere in there. That's right, that's right. All right, Electabuzz, the Bramlin, the Giraffe Rug, the... Oh, hang on, overhead cam. Yeah. Iron Hands, the Morty's Conviction, the Shiftry, the Yamper, the Perilous Jungle, and the, the Gouging, Gouging Fire, Fire, which we oh. know is just two points. Yeah, yes indeed. Bam, so pulled the Ultra Rare, and even a Fire card for Team Fire, but not quite 
the points they were hoping for. Unfortunately for Doe there, but well played either which way. Doe also one of our moderators over on Discord, so shout yep. out to Doe as so always. So Fire looks like they've only got two players left on the day, but next up we've got uh, Lauren Classic. Classic Lauren. Classic Lauren, as it were. Yeah. Here we go, this is going to be... Not to be confused with Master Lauren, another Lauren, just Lauren, Lauren B. Not another Lauren. Okay. All right. We got the raucous pummely, the heat pummely, <laughs> the, the heat more, the roly coly, the azumarill, the yamper, the iron hands, the heavy baton, well, the, the missed energy. Yeah, that's our first of the day, is it not? Maybe second. Yeah, second. Yeah. The tora cat, the iron treads will not score, and the um, alligator. Oh, there we man, go. There so you just go. three points for classic Lauren. Go ahead and put your nice sensor bar there. We don't want to be showing off. Let's keep it family friendly, you know? Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. We're family yeah. friendly, show around these bits. There we go. You know so, those for alligators, man. Yeah. Notable glutes. They hit that squat day. They ain't skipping. All right, next up is Taylor Stell for their third pack ever. Third pack ever for Taylor Stell. Never been able to, uh, it, like, came in late in season nine, one pack season in season 10. Yep. Are well, we those are both. One pack seasons. One pack seasons, you're right. Yeah. Okay, yep. So this is the first three pack seasons. We're about to see what Taylor's made of. Exactly. Shroomish, Lickitung, Slugma, oh, Solosis, the Zera Aura, the Iron Shrubby, the Shrubby, there we go. Man, that, that feels like it should be worth something, doesn't it? I know. We, I think we've <laughs> talked before about having something if you get all the random chosen common chase cards. Oh, uh, but. Obviously, that's not in effect right now. So, Relicanth, there we go. So, it's going to be four points off oh. all three chase cards. How about that? Playing a fierce game, Taylor. So, you know, this this is someone who everybody's always looked at exclusively as a rookie because yeah. they've only had like the one packs. Right. And this is so nobody knows how Taylor's going to perform in a season like this. That's yeah. a good showing. That was a good four points. Solid. Nice. Not bad. Next up is Wilhelmina coming off a three point season and a four point season, but their last. Their last three pack season, they got up to 21. So they've been known to pull some cards here. Okay, all right, so let's see, we got the Victini, the Bronze Aura, the Mudbray, the Ghastly. Oh, here we score, go. The Buddy Buddy Poffin, the Iron Tread, the Box Order, the Mel Metal will score, the Skitty will not, and the Mariadon will. So one, two, three, four, five, six Six points, points there, that Buddy Buddy Poffin doing a lot of the work. It is indeed, yeah, Half there we go. It. That is such a good card to get, like with a multiplier too, because you get yeah, like it gives you straight. It's, it's an uncommon card worth yeah. six points all of a sudden. Yeah, really good value on that one. All right, uh, next up we have Anthony. Anthony, so this is the other son of Doe. Also playing for Team Fire. Not the one who has won the comp before that. Right, exactly. All right, so can uh, can they bring the family more glory? We'll we're about to find out. Let's see. Ba bam, ba bam. We've got the Raucous Pummeling Energy, the Rosalia, the Cutie Fly, Drill Burr. Relore, Bianca's Devotion, Iron Jugulus, Lycan Rock, the Slug Mobile Score. score. Oh, oh! The Mudsdale! Haven't seen that one yet. That's a great card. Very Looking good. Looking very nice. And that's going to be, what, 175? And the Fralligator here will give you a nice little uh, sensor, sensor bar. bar. All right, so the Mudsdale, beautiful card. Just $1.83 in value, but I think it's worth it. I think it's worth it just for the pulse. Okay, yeah, two, three, four. Four points. Four so points. For Anthony. There we go. All right, next up we have Andriana. Andriana. Oh man, who was who was your hated rival? We Blood, talked about you. Blood last. vamp. Blood vamp. Blood vamp. Exactly. Exactly. For Team Electric, here we go. So, see see what they got for us for today. Team Electric. They're coming off a bit of a slump here. He only had uh, what five points across the last two seasons. So looking looking for some big pulls. Yep. No doubt. No doubt. Oh, but they were in Big Steve contention back in season eight. So they were real. Oh, I think they got. It. They might have. They might have gotten it. Because ever at 18, I have once one for Big Steve, and then they got one point. So, and a five cent car. So I have no idea if they got one or not. But looks like they came close. Could have been. It could have been in it. Yeah. No, oh, Scyther. Scyther, Skiddy, Electabuzz, Bramblin, Metagross, Roserade, Caldeo, the Shaman, the Great Tusk, and the Bramble Gast. So we got the Bramblin, Bramblin and the Bramblin. So got the full Evo line there, but that's just going to be a one point pack. Yeah, the number 21 is going to be worth just five cents. So I think it's worth writing down. Absolutely. So good for last place right here. There we go. So if this is, if Andriana has won the Big Steve award, this might be like, like maybe she's just trying to play the bingo card. Right, you know, you're you just know, trying to get like, the trophies. Yeah, it's like, you know, I've, I've won Big Steve, I've won last place. Right. Shower me in medals. Exactly. I don't care where I win, just that I win. All right, next up we have Elara Evergreen opening just their second pack ever. Okay, so Evergreen just takes me back to one of my Hunger Games theories that the, who's the traveling troop? 
Uh, the Covey. The Covey. The Covey. They all have all their last names are colors, and I I believe that Katniss's last name Everdeen was once Evergreen. Evergreen, I agree. Evergreen, yeah, yeah. and it was changed so that people didn't know she was part of the Covey. All right, so let's see here. So we got that metal energy there. We got the Grubbin, the Medicham, the Tranquil, the Mister Mind, the Sandy but Shock. These two showing up together. No. Was it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they did show yeah. up together. Yep. Weird. The Behem thing. Rapidash, the Drillbur, the Pikachu, and the Drampa. Oh, the one point Drampa pack. And then just that's it. It yeah, does feel like three. we're in a bit of a slump still, Ben. We are. So five cents as well for the Drampa. So also worth writing down there for Miss Evergreen. There we go. Of the Covey. Of probably. the Covey, probably. All right. Okay. If anyone can break us out of our slump, Ben, it's Brooke. Brooke! Her team. Is Water. Brooke not one of the ones that has pulled the 230 yeah. point pack? Yes, yes. Brooke, Brooke is a former season champion who has pulled the single best pack in Box Breakers history at 230 points. Let's see what she's got today. Can you imagine? Can you we imagine? we had like a huge, a big, big one, right? We've had well, the ace backs. Yeah, we had the, yeah, we got the 22 points for Big Jake there and the 70 points for Braun. All right, rep in water. The Ponyta, the Cottony, the Chadot, Carolina Salvador, Palafin, Screamtail, Codebreaker, Lickitung, and, oh, and no! Grandpa. No, Brooke! Come on, not what we expected. Not what we expected out of you. Is that back-to-back -back Drampas? Back-to-back one-point Drampa packs? Oh, that oh, is painful. That is painful. That's hard to see. That's hard, hard to, to see. You'd hate, I mean, for such a seasoned pro as well, like It's okay, bro. Just, just dust it off That's next right. month. Come back you next month. This. It's okay. We're not, you know, we know you got it in you. Next up is uh, Kingdom Cam. Kingdom Cam. Kingdom Cam. For Team right. Fire. Also, only their second pack ever. So a couple more rookies. It's nice to see them getting more reps under their belts here. That's you know? exactly right. Getting playtime in the big leagues. We got the Eyeball Energy, the Finizen, the Dunsparce, the Snom, the Pikachu, the Rabombi, the Future Booster Energy Capsule, the Iron Hands, the Mist, Mist energy. energy. We'll score the Cutie Fly would have last week in the Scovelin. Scovelin. So yeah. just, I think this is just worth one point though in the Scovelin. Yeah, 20, 42 cents. We'll round it to one point. Mist so, energy is two, so three points total. Three points total. We're almost at the end. All right, Ben, two packs left. We've got Low Skill Rob, who is somehow not, is this Low Skill Rob of, are there, there rivals with uh, Below Average Gaming Dad? The one and only. Yeah, all right, so let's see, I forget what they got. I think they had three points last episode. Let's see if Low Skill Rob can, uh, you know, overskill them here. Let's see. We got the Fire Energy, the Raichu, which I feel like we haven't seen a lot of. Victini, Bronzor, Mudbray, Bolton, Mudsdale, Saucebuck. Oh, we have a critical hit. Oh no way! Mudbray. Okay. And the Lycan Rock and the Bramble Gas. Man. Uh, so just two points just with the with points. the multiplier and Even everything. With the crit can't take down Low Skill or, or no, uh, below, below Average, average gaming, gaming Dad. Dad. Man. Jeez. The rivalry continues, but it's a close fought match at the moment. So no we'll, we'll keep an eye on that and keep you guys posted as we go forward. All right, last pack magic, Maddie. Let's see it. All right, Maddie. I'm feeling, you know what? It wouldn't, I, I'm, I'm feeling it, Ben. I'm feeling it. You're feeling it? I'm feeling it. You feel good? I feel good about this one. Have we only had the one, what are the, what are those A-spec cards? We had, we think we had two. We had the, the, we have the belt and the, the Master Ball. The mas oh, yeah, the Master Ball is the first pack. Yeah, yeah, yeah there we go. The, catcher. the Scyther, the, the Good Omen. The, yeah, Sizzlepeed, the Meryl, the Golit, the Rescue Board, the Sandy Shocks, the Hand Trimmer, the Crydon will score, the Charger Bug will not, and the Melt oh, Metal. Oh, like I was saying, I was not feeling it yeah, for this pack. Yeah, yeah, so just two <laughs> points two overall points, for Maddie. You did get a Scyther, so Assigned there's Assigned Scyther, right. no less. So that makes it worth maybe something more in the future. Maybe, we'll who's see. to say? Yeah, who's to say indeed. There we go. Enjoy, Maddie. These cards will be headed your direction. As for always, we occasionally get questions and comments and people are asking, do people actually get the cards? And the answer to that question is yes. yes. Every single week, we have a giant mail bucket that we take on down to the post office that drops off each and every one of these packs to go out to our patrons. If you too would like to sign up and have us open a pack for you, you could do so by heading on over to patreon.com slash Super Carling Gaming and selecting any of the Box Breakers tiers. And don't forget, you can always upgrade for our quarterly merch club where you can get cool stuff like our playing mats. Look at our playing mats. Or our yes. tote bag. Yeah, yeah, really cool stuff. So be sure to check it out. Link in the description down below. Otherwise, until next time, Hariyama! Hariyama!